There's a piece of toast there. But no toast is here. But no toast there. I'm teaching Grayson about spot the differences. Um, Anthony's grandma got Grayson a subscription to Highlight Magazines. And previously he's been too small to really understand them but i got it out yesterday just to try something different since it's getting cold outside and i'm trying to find more things to do inside and so i got these books out or these magazines i guess is what they're called and he two actually spiders. really enjoys them two spiders. two spiders there but three spiders there he um his favorite parts big are the spider. big spider there spider. Here. But no spiders there. Um, he absolutely loves the find the hidden object he, ones. Those are his favorite. And he actually he is goes. pretty good after I find them for him he for the first goes. time. Two ghosts. But no ghosts there. So we're just chilling, reading our highlight magazine. I got Porter with me. He is two months old today how is he so big mm -hmm. but yes porter is two months old today i cannot believe another month has gone by time is just flying um so i need to do a photo shoot with his two month sticker on and everything else i weighed him yesterday because we don't have his next doctor's appointment to find out his true height and weight until next week so i weighed him last night you guys he is 13 pounds oh my gosh i cannot believe it i mean he's heavy so i i mean i can believe it but that's so crazy um when grayson was two months he was only 12 pounds so porter is a chunker so yes he is so big he is um smiling he's found his hands he's currently gnawing on his hand right now do you like those hands porter is it so fun he has not rolled over since last month um, when I caught it on video. So he's only rolled over three times. So I wonder if that was just a fluke or something. He used to love tummy time and now he absolutely hates tummy time. So hopefully he'll get into that more um, this next month now that he's two months old. But it's I think it's still pretty early to be rolling anyway. Another thing that's happening today is my sister Allison is coming back over to hang out with me and the kids. We are going to go shopping for Christmas stuff. I saw Hobby Lobby has like Christmas stuff half off. So I think we're going to go check that out. And of course we have to get ice cream today. So um, I'll try to vlog some of those shenanigans. But Grayson is getting very jealous that I am not paying attention to him and I am vlogging. So I won't vlog too much longer right now. But... Yes, we are going to take a photo shoot of Porter. I will input some pictures here of the pictures that I get of him. because it's actually been really hard the past couple of days with Porter. He has been so extremely fussy, you guys, crying nonstop, wanting to be held nonstop. Supposedly, it's just part of this developmental leap that he's going through. Um, there's something called the Wonder Weeks app. There's also a book of it too, but most people have the app. And it basically just tells you the different developmental leaps that your baby goes through. Um, different sensations that they learn as their brain develops and so I guess this month or this developmental leap is patterns so he's starting to realize that like he has arms and hands and they're attached to him and just different things like that and so it can be sorry that Grayson is just repeating himself over and over again I'm ignoring him so I can talk to you guys 
But anyway, he's learning patterns, and so it can be a little overwhelming for him. And so he just constantly wants to be held. And so it's been really, really tough lately. Yesterday was a really bad day. He cried most of the day. And it's just strange because I don't remember Grayson crying this much, and I did not have to hold Grayson this much, I don't think. And it's even tougher because I have a toddler who wants my attention just as much as the baby does. So it's been a really tough couple days. Supposedly, um, with Porter being two months old today, we are supposed to be out of the leap. But we'll see if anything really changes. I mean, I'm holding him right now and he's pretty happy. So we'll see um, as the day goes on. The toughest part has been naps during the day. He's still doing awesome at night and sleeping through the night. But naps during the day, he will not nap unless I'm holding him and rocking him, which is not what I want to do. If he's napping, I want him, I want to put him down. So I need to just put him more on like a napping schedule and actually like put him in his bassinet instead of me holding him so I can break like that bad habit. Um, that'll get easier once we move the beds around and get Grayson into his big boy bed. It's just hard because Anthony's working this weekend, so we don't have time to do that. But we are going to get there. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> So it's the next day, ho ho, put it on the tree, you can do it. I got out some Christmas decorations. I realize I really don't have that many. I guess I should go get some more. But anyway, my mom got this for Grayson a couple years ago. This is just the first time we're breaking it out. Snowflake, it's a felt Christmas tree and then you can see it's got a bunch of sticky places where you can basically decorate his own Christmas tree. Another snowflake. It's kind of like, since it was compressed for so many years, it's taking a while to actually like smooth out, candy. but candy. Grayson is loving decorating it and maybe this will keep him away from the real tree when we get a tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I got this felt tree out. I put it in the playroom since it's really for gray. I also got this um, nativity scene last year for my grandma. And I was kind of confused when I was putting it out. So if you're familiar with the nativity scene, like obviously this is baby Jesus, mom, Mary, dad, Joseph, and then you've got the three wise men. But I'm very confused on who this dude is. Like, who is he? I'm not quite sure. So um, anyway, I put it out and Gray likes it. And they're like, they're not glass. I don't think. I think they're just plastic. So I don't think he can break them, hopefully. <laughs> but I like the white. Like, I think it's pretty. My sister thinks this dude might be the innkeeper. Um, or the the barn dude, I'm guessing. Um, but yeah, let me know if you know who this dude is. Also, I'm very confused because their beard's color don't match their hair color. Snowflake. Snowflake, that's right, go put it on the tree. You want mama to do it? All right, I guess I'm gonna decorate the tree for Grayson. So this has been keeping him occupied, so that's been nice. I also have this snowman up. It's a countdown to Christmas, my mom gave me that. This is another countdown to Christmas. Every day you hang up a new ornament. And I remember from last year, these are so hard to hang on because the buttons are not easy. So I'm sure it's gonna give me more trouble this year, but at least Gray will be more into like helping me hang stuff. Cause last year he was very confused on what was going on. I also put up Grayson stocking and um, I realized I need to get Porter a stocking, so I'm going to, I always go to Pottery Barn. I think their stockings are the cutest, and I love how you can personalize them. So I'm going to get Porter a stocking. Um, I'll probably wait till Black Friday for their Black Friday deals. Hopefully they have something, and I also need another stocking hanger thingy. The problem with this house is we don't have a mantle. I wanted Anthony to build one or buy one and install it for me. But now that we're about to sell the house, if we ever find a new house, it's kind of like, 
there's probably no point in us doing that right now. Unless I can convince Anthony. I don't know how expensive those things are, but. What are you doing? Hey, no, no, put that back. It's not Christmas time yet. He's already doing the countdown to Christmas. It's not even December. Oh boy, I probably should have put this up higher. Anyway, so I need to get another stocking hanger and another stocking. This stocking hanger, Gray kept pulling at a stocking last year, and so it's actually broken. So I really need two new stocking hangers. And Anthony and I don't have stockings for each other. So I know some families do, but we're like, why? When we grew up, our parents didn't have stockings, so we probably won't have our own stockings. I also have these um, Christmas pillows. I just got that one yesterday when we went shopping. I meant to record um, a little bit of us shopping, but you guys, it was so crazy yesterday. We went to Hobby Lobby, Dollar Store, and we went to Target, and it was so packed. The Hobby Lobby lines to pay, I swear we waited like 20 minutes. It was so long. Um, I don't know if it's because all of their Christmas stuff was 50% off or if people are freaking out thinking that um, the Ohio governor is going to shut down Ohio again because coronavirus cases are increasing. We're at seven to 8,000 a day. And also um, all the toilet paper is being hoarded again. So it's really hard to find toilet paper and other things in the grocery stores. So I'm wondering if people are freaking out about that and trying to get like all their Christmas decorations in last minute or early, I guess, because it's not December yet. So anyway, it was chaos in there and Porter only wanted to be held. So I had to hold him everywhere. Grayson wanted to be held. So my sister had to hold him. It was just a lot. And so um, I really didn't record anything, but I did get this let it snow pillow which i think is really cute these i've had uh for a couple years but that one is a new one and i like how it's red and it pops out um compared to the two white pillows so i like it um hopefully anthony won't be too mad at me that i bought that <laughs> but that's the only christmas thing i bought and i could have bought a ton more things because everything was 50 percent off grayson has had me take this off the wall now so he can reach all of the ornaments so hopefully we don't lose any I hope I don't regret doing that. No, I'm not going to help you. I'm not going to help him destroy all the ornaments. Um, Porter is still snoozing away. I will show you him on the monitor. Uh, here he is. This is our bedroom. And he's just snoozing away. And you guys, it is 9.04. And he is still sleeping. He woke up once at 7 to feed and he's been sleeping ever since and I am shocked. He's a sleepy boy. I just wanted to show you some of our Christmas stuff. I'm realizing I really don't have a lot of Christmas things. I still have um, these two garlands to hang. I have garlands that I hang on the fireplace that say Merry Christmas and then I have another one that's stars. So I am planning on doing that. I just realized my face might have been zoomed in in those last couple clips, so sorry if it was. I didn't realize it was still zoomed in. Anyway, I'm tired.